I should have hit him with my car. What's up everyone? Adam Johnson here with Johnson Racing. The following is a quick video of some of the stuff that went down on Saturday night with Landon Huffman and Annabeth Barnes. We at Johnson Racing and all of our partners are not affiliated with either team. This is solely for the media and a journalistic approach to everything that went down. Before we get into it, Zemo, did you know that 85% of the people watching our videos aren't subscribed? Really? He says that's crazy. Y'all hit the subscribe button, give us a like, give us a follow, give us a share. We are gonna be bringing you some great content. We got our race day vlog coming next. It'll be up probably by Thursday. Yeah, stay tuned. Hope you enjoy this. Let's get it going. Clark Houston now able to barely just get out in front of Crum, but business is about to pick up as Matthews and Huffman now have caught the leaders are right beside them at this restart, and anything can happen. They're going to try to make it three wide, coming off a of turn two. I don't believe it. All three cars make it through there. Landon Huffman, oh, he pushes Crum out of the way. She's sideways, all into everything. Down across the front side of the racetrack, pandemonium ensues. Well, that is two race car drivers that will not be finishing tonight, and I guarantee you somebody is not getting a Christmas card this year.
I got it pretty good though. Yeah, well, I got a couple good swings in before I got. Well, yeah, blindsided him. I know. He hit me before I could get him. I Once I got my hand around his neck, around his head, I took that so he boards the head first. <laughs> <laughs> Third in the first race, won the limited race, and then uh, there in that second twin, just kept getting caught in uh, the wrong line. Finally worked our way up to third or fourth there on a restart, late restart, like eight to go or something. I got outside of Annabeth. She's in the in the way like every week. One reason she's up there is because she's playing the invert. She qualifies like shit, runs like shit, finishes in the invert, and then she's up there in the way. Uh, rolled outside of her. She squeezed me in the fence off two, and then. Uh, we got down here to three, laid into her a little bit, knocked her up the track. She tried to right rear me. She f***ed up, missed, spun herself out, no damage, and then decided she was going to come back around and full throttle me while her uh, while her uh, follower of Christ's husband um, arm barred dad and blindsided him out of nowhere and then tried to be f***ed out of him. It's uncalled for. I mean, tore up race cars for no reason, and uh, I don't know. She's always, she's, once a dumb she's always a dumb Damn. Should have hit him with my car. And ladies and gentlemen, that is the words of Landon Huffman after he endured a crazy night at Hickory Motor Speedway, a roller coaster of emotions with a third and then a win and then, uh, you know, crazy drama. Yeah, that just happens sometimes. It's racing. I'm glad he and Rob are okay. Um, I hate everything that happened to everyone this stuff like that just should not happen at short track racing or any racing period but um it did and that's how it goes sometimes all i can say is come out and watch some short track racing this stuff is awesome it always brings action it's one of the best things you can do on a saturday night so come out to hickory motor speedway if you're in the area if not find your local track go to them support the local short track racers and let's go have some fun y'all know what it is Keep the pedal to the metal and I'll see you at the finish line.